My guy is really gonna struggle through this game. <laughs> Why is that? <laughs> You'll see and find out. I found myself a stranger in a strange land. Figuring out my key bindings, navigating the tutorial, and no items or home to call my own. But I slowly began to build up my skills and my possessions. All I've done so far is just go around harvesting stuff. Even learning to supply myself with weapons, tools, and clothing. I wanted to safely reunite with my friends, but the wilderness would prove dangerous and have different ideas as I came across my very first foe. I wonder if I'll die to those. I don't want anybody to tell. Oh, it's like an- oh shit, it's an anteater. It's gonna kill me. Ah, run away! Run away from the anteater! The so-called anteater, which was in fact not an anteater at all, but still a neutral beast that otherwise would not have harmed me had I not attacked, had proven more dangerous than initially expected. Don't attempt to kill the anteaters, it won't go well. Time to kill the anteater again. Oh shit. I have a blood. Oh, I'm dead. I've never died in this game. I'd like to just say this part of my guild application. Oh. The anteater killed me. It's starting to think he eats more than ants. Dying to the <laughs> anteater hurt my pride, but I would never again let this beast uh, best me. Where's my dead body? Oh, okay. Alright, I'm gonna kill this ant eater, mother trucker. Spear of melee. Uh oh. Stamina. Physique is health. Ah! Oh, I killed the ant eater. There's no one more powerful in our tribe than me. Might be the mightiest kill so far. <laughs> yeah. My ego easily seduced, my victory quickly went to my head, and I began to show dominance over the once scary beast. Oh shit. I've killed so many animals, I'm the... So strong. I haven't found him yet. Oh, what is that? Is that like a crab? Oh, it hears me. What is that? Oh, it's a turkey. There's a little lake nearby me, um, maybe just west of me that seems good, like a little island. I'll head there. I was unstoppable. I was on my way to proving to be the most valuable provider in the tribe, and my tribesmen and I had finally agreed to meet up at a more centralized location. But I easily got distracted by the potential promise of my first slaves, though I did not know how to tame them. I've killed like 18 ant eaters for you guys. I'm. Oh! There's an outcast. Are they my friends or my foe? Do I target them? Ooh. <laughs> Hello. So how do I capture a woman? Oh wow, turkeys just what what were you saying, Kelly? How do I capture the woman? I don't know. Make them mine. No, it's a good thing Kelly wasn't a man. Oh I am a man. The no, Kelly, right. god damn it. I should not have said that. Now we're gonna hear all about it. Without any obvious potential for using my charming good looks and charisma to convince these women to join me, or in other words, not knowing the game mechanics and not realizing that I had already spent my soul mask bar, I resorted to the last option that made sense. Attack the NPC tribeswoman and see what would happen. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh, I'm about to kill the woman. You guys are coming up to me, like, right? Or am I going down to you? We're going to you. 
Okay. Missing. I killed the women. I was trying to just love them, but I accidentally pressed the wrong button. Hmm. I feel bad for killing the people that I was trying to make my slaves. I was discouraged, but I ventured on. Oh. You? There's another two more friends. How do I make friends with them? You're supposed to get them under 10% health, and then somehow you, like, to make them your person. Make them your Wait, who's slave. This? Oh, that's Trevor. I thought another slave was coming. Hello, women. Hello, women friends. The next set of NPC tribeswomen were equally unconvinced by my negotiation tactics, but this time they were stronger. The slot I leave for building stuff keeps getting filled with nuts. Oh, balls. No, nuts, actually. The healing pants? Oh, I'm gonna die! Bye! Run away! I narrowly escaped just long enough to meet a seemingly tame creature that is anything but. Oh, what is that animal? Oh, it's gonna kill me. Oh, it's oh, gonna kill me. Oh! Oh! You need to run, run. While I made my husband fight off the creatures for me and left him to die, I finally found the rest of my tribe and got to see their character creations for the first time. And some customization sliders were used more liberally than others. Hello, my slaves. Little, little, little bitch, get out of here. Hello, slave one. You can't build here because there's a Look damn Look out, the thing's in there. Hello, slave two. Oh! Look out, Look out for that shit. shit. Bush dog. Come here, dude. Oh, shit. And hello, slave three. Let me see my slaves. <laughs> So He's I can't awesome. build here because of the stupid Kelly. nest. Can we get rid of this thing? <laughs> <laughs> oh. Yeah, we did. We, we did look at each other. We're so skinny. <laughs> Why does it keep blaring? <laughs> We're emaciated. Oh, oh, no. what the hell's going on? We look like little oh. birds. <laughs> we do. I went with the bowl cut, though. And Lacey maxed out the breast slider. I did not. It's actually less than half. <laughs> oh, wow, really? Yeah, they you have really big breasts. <laughs> At last, I was reunited with my friends, which was when the real fun of the game began. Can I kill you? Oh, I'm harder to hit, Lacey, because I'm so thin. <laughs> <laughs> that right there. <laughs> Trevor dance, the dance of our people. <laughs> My loincloth is more loiny than yours. Is it? Actually, it is. I am wearing clothes. I was too, but I think I must have gotten injured and lost them all. While we were thoroughly productive in making our friend Ryan build the base while we enjoyed annoying each other, more adventures were yet to come as we would explore the world.